guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, welcome back to my kitchen, whoever doesn't know me, my name is Svetlana and today I want to show you an excellent, excellent recipe for our dietary chicken zucchini patties, katletki. This recipe, all we need, we need grounded chicken, we need zucchini, eggs, garlic, I love cilantro, but my son Samuel, who is filming me right now, hates cilantro. So I'm gonna make half with cilantro and half without cilantro. And why it's gonna be so dietary? Because for breadcrumbs, I'm gonna use homemade uh, breadcrumbs from 647 bread. This bread is so low on carbs, it's only six grams of carbs. And it's delicious. Usually I don't like anything dietary when it, because it changes the taste. But this bread, this breadcrumbs from this bread does not change the taste. So if I could skip on calories, I would definitely do it. And my kids, they always on the diet. It's great for them. They could always eat it every day. So let's begin. How I make my breadcrumbs? I take two slices of bread and I put it in a toaster. For now, let me prep my zucchini because I need to shred it and leave it for like 10 minutes to release all the liquid. So now I'm just straight shredding my zucchini straight into a calendar and I'm gonna add a little bit of salt and let it stay for 10 minutes until it's gonna release most of the water because we don't know, we don't want our patties to be too watery. So all we do, we just Shred it, add a pinch of salt or a teaspoon of salt and mix it and just let it stay. You want to see a crazy dog eating zucchini? Here we go. Yes, go, we enjoy. He loves everything. Zucchini, potato, anything he'll eat. So now I will add a little bit of salt, mix it up and just let it stay until it's gonna release most of it liquid. And I'll see you soon. So, my zucchini drained for about 20 minutes. Now I'm gonna make my homemade made breadcrumbs. I toasted my bread and just gonna break it into my magic bullet. And just gonna pulse it for a few seconds until it's gonna become breadcrumbs. So my breadcrumbs are ready and all we do right now we transfer our grounded chicken into a mixing bowl. We break two eggs inside. Crush. We crush. We crush some garlic. Oops. Done. And we add our zucchini. And believe me guys, this chicken patty is gonna be so, so juicy because zucchini have so much moist and just, it, this is so, so delicious. I love zucchini pancakes and this is great source of protein because it's kind of zucchini pancakes but also have chicken inside. So we add our breadcrumbs, we also add our salt and sugar, I mean sugar and pepper. Salt and pepper, don't add sugar, it's not gonna taste good. So we add a salt and pepper to taste and we just mix it. How I like to do it, I like to put on the glove and just mix everything well with my hand, just like that. So Samuel was so nice to me and he agreed on eating cilantro. He said that when it's not fresh, when it's cooked, it's not as strong and he can eat it. So I'm adding my cilantro just to taste as much as or little as you want. You could add parsley, you could add any other herbs, just literally your taste preference, but I love it just like that. Okay, now let's come to my stove and preheat our skillet. It needs to be hot. Now we add about two tablespoons of oil, frying oil. Let it also heat up for a few seconds. We're gonna start making our patties. We take a spoon full and we kind of spread them out just like that. 
just like that. Don't put them too close to each other because it's gonna be hard to flip. You could make them smaller, you could make them larger. Whatever you like. That's the great thing about homemade cooking, that you could adjust everything to your taste preferences. And I'll show you how they look when I'm gonna flip them. We're gonna carefully turn them. And this is how they look. And trust me guys, they are delicious. They're gonna be melting in your mouth. They're gonna be very, very juicy. And this is gonna be your favorite way to make chicken patties. All right guys, so when they the same color on the bottom, because I don't wanna cover it right away because it's not gonna get that beautiful color. So you fry them on one side, you turn them, you fry them on the other side. And when the other side is this color, you cover them. You put your heat a little bit lower because they, they're a little thick and you wanna cover them for another two minutes just to make sure that the chicken is cooked through. And by the way, we fry them on a medium heat and when we cover it, you make medium low. And then you go bring it up and you do the rest. So guys, when it's ready, you take them out on a bounce paper towel. I always say bounce, yeah, on a paper towel to let it absorb the extra oil that we don't need. And we continue frying on the same pan. We may need to add a little more frying oil and we continue frying the rest. So guys, I just took them out and this is how much you get from one pound of chicken and one medium large zucchini. So this is how much you get. So if you want more, you obviously get more. And into the description, I'm gonna write down everything, how much I use. I'm gonna try it now. And I love them. I already made them so many times. Mm. I could do this every day all day and not feeling guilty. They are so juicy and so delicious. Zucchini takes it to a whole different level. I mean, everybody make chicken. I cannot say burgers, it's kind of chicken meatballs, but they're not round and Russian is katliate. The shape, we all make them. But zucchini adds so much to it and cilantro, of course. And even Samuel said that he liked it with cilantro because it's not as strong as a fresh one. You taste a little bit. I mean, to me, it's delicious. So guys, thank you so much for watching me. I need to eat it, because I'll eat a few more. So delicious. Thank you so much for watching me. Subscribe to my YouTube channel so you don't miss any more of my delicious videos. And thumb up, comments down below. 